Hello and welcome to another tip series video. Today I'll be doing something actually out of the game and uh, providing alternatives to matchmaking. Very recently uh, matchmaking has actually been dead awful. The variants on online servers have um, <coughs> been pretty much impossible to actually use. So I've been actually looking at alternatives. A lot of these are actually previously known about um, but but today I'll be showing you plugging services and the price if any and the benefits and cons of using each service so we'll bring up the browser here and uh, we'll go to Gameface GameFaceLeague.com is a UK based uh, organization and most recently they've actually created a pickup service and within this service um, you can start queuing and has a separate anti cheat which is actually entwined with e easy anti cheat which um, Leapway a lot of other pug services use. This however is in beta. Gameface is extremely popular within the UK and the European scene so far. Um, it's taken over from a lot of the other previous leagues that were existing in uh, the UK. For example Enemy Down and uh, SGL UNGL as well, pretty much, um, but now they provide a plugging service. Unfortunately, it's not very busy at the moment. Um, if we go to the site home, we can see only one really player is queuing. That is the main issue of it. Also, being in beta, it is, can obviously have bugs. It's prone to bugs at the, at the moment, but over time, if the popularity grows, which I'm sure it will, the service is great. 128 tick service and it's completely free. <clears throat> so that's one service. Great for the European scene and great for the UK. I'm glad Surreal and the rest of the team have been able to provide this. Then we move on to Face It. And Face It is great for um, general cups. We actually played this um, when I was in HD Fuse. You can see our little team when it was there. Um, we used to play as um, a couple cups and stuff, but you can actually play um, pug services as well. So you can select I'm playing alone as a mix. Some services do cost. Um, I'm not exactly on the exact price of them. And uh, you can get either points which accumulate and you can collect them towards um, particular get giveaways or prizes or the bigger ones, the proper championships, which I think, well, you will have to qualify for and uh, you're eligible for a hundred dollars for example so not a lot but it's a great service as well and uh, I would highly recommend this one as well goods within both EU and American um, you can select European or American service depends where you are in the and your location the next one we look at is the ESCA personally I don't use this um, just for personal reasons and uh, the subscription cost is $6.95 a month um, this is to play with the pug services and I know for a fact within the American um, scene this is very popular and ECA is great um, now like the whole Bitcoin fiasco is gone a lot of people are having a lot more faith in it and the team have tried to uh, regain that trust but personally um, I would only pay for it if I was actually playing within the league. The pug service is not really necessary um, as I use IRC but I'll discuss that in another game, um, in another video, sorry. And then, so what's the benefits of using this? Um, you will have a lot less dropouts compared to the free services. The free services unfortunately provide a lot of great features um, it's like the 128 service and um, able to bring a lot of uh, people together but this is very popular and ensures that people actually play because they're paying for the service and uh, again it's an easy way to get a game the next one we move to is Leapway and then Altpug another similar service as well these two services pretty much took over um, Jolt Play. Um, if you remember CSS mixes, this service is basically going to the lobby, um, 
selecting which team you'd like to play, starting up the easy anti cheat or whichever anti cheat they use, and then start playing from there. You can easily um, select one of the services, servers, sorry, and then um, create what map you'd like. Again, a great service and easy to use, and I just love the simplicity of the site. Um, you want to be able to just go on there and see what's happening and Leapway does that very well. Old Pug, I like the clean aesthetic to it but again extremely similar to Leapway. Um, the service is you just select the lobby that you want, join the team, team or game and um, go from there. So again a very easy service to use and they're all intertwined with um, the Steam API so you're able to log in through Steam and it gives you that security, that integrity that you need and it can also provide back stats that um, can be gained from Steam and then the alt pug or leetway services can use it. So today guys I just wanted to provide you a little bit of an overview of what is available within the pugging services and give me your opinion on it. What do you personally use? Um, I've been able to use Faceit um, when I had premium ECA sometimes but majority of the time I'm very fortunate and uh, have enough to either get 10 mans going or um, just have normal mixes but I'll discuss that in another video. Until then guys, bye bye.